Welcome back. It is the 22nd of August and uh, Kaylee and I are out doing some some chores to get ready for the hunting season. I wanted to give everybody an update on the food plots. This is the two acre plot right here in the pasture. Everything's looking really good. Kaylee and I just came around the corner and there is a two year old eight point that took off running right from being out here already. I don't know why he was already out here, but he was out here munching on stuff. Everything's coming up really, really good. We got pretty good, uh, you know, distance between plants out in there. Over in here, it's quite a bit thicker. You can see where it got pretty wet by that ditch over there. But for the most part, everything's looking really good. I'm gonna, I got a whole bunch of cameras I'm gonna get out, uh, starting. I've got probably 15 cameras out right now, but uh, I'm going to put out a whole bunch more. I've got my box of cameras here and the, the strategy is everything, you know, a lot of these areas that are super accessible, I'll put just normal uh, trail cameras up. But, uh, you know, if I get into where these deer are, are spending a lot of time, I'll put cell cameras up because you really don't want to go in there and disturb stuff. And I'll put the, uh, the cell cams like these right here, like the Keen Ranger PT is the one I'm going to set up right here at this overlooking this food plot with the solar panel. It'll it gets really good sunlight out here and being able to tra traverse that camera is huge because I can scan the whole food plot. So nothing has to be in front of it. You know, if it's right before dark and I just want to see what's out here, I can I can uh, hook up to the camera right through the right through my cell phone and just scan the whole food plot and see what's out here. So that's super handy. But we're going to go ahead and I'm going to get a camera up right here and get a few more over here on the edge and start getting all these buggers out here. You really want to know when, if you're hunting a particular deer, you really need to know where that deer is and when he's there, especially during hunting season. That's really important information for you to know if you're trying to kill that deer. So let's get after it here. We got the camera set up right here and it's connected and we can overlook the whole food plot right here and it's got good sunlight on that solar panel i use the eot club data cards and all these cameras i can manage them right from my cell phone super simple super easy there's a link in the description if you guys want to check those data cards out and then uh, i'll take and mark this camera on onyx and keep all of them marked i end up putting out over right around 100 every year so i've got to keep them marked otherwise i won't remember where they're at I don't have my phone. Six done the huh? Kaylee and I have got a whole bunch of cameras set up so far and now we're in the uh, old garden plot and it's gonna give you a good look at it here. You can see everything's coming up real good. We're pretty wet down here in this bottom corner, but there's nothing you can really do about that. The top's looking really, really good. You can see uh, right in the middle of where I was spreading, it's a little bit uh, thick, but on the edges, it's like the perfect seed rate. Like right in there, there's lots of uh, room for those brassicas to really express, you know, their full potential. It's growing like crazy up there on the hill. Everything's looking good though. This weekend, we're gonna be planting the hidey hole food plots. Still got a bunch of cameras to set up. I'm gonna get over to the Pennsylvania lease and get uh, a bunch of cell cams in there, see what's going on. And I'll be giving everybody an update on the deer activity and kind of what deer I'm obviously gonna be probably chasing this year. So that's on an upcoming video. This is just a, kind of a short one showing you these food plots here. And uh, we'll run up to the upper farm and uh, show you that one too. I got a camera up there I wanted to check quick.